okay we'll talk what is importance of legalizing prostitution in sri lanka in appropriate way here in sri lanka it is legal but not in an appropriate way it must be legalized in an appropriate way because this is the thing so many massage clinics in sri lanka not everyone every massage clinic is massaging eh yes massaging plus sex okay sometimes husband doesn't know that wife is in the massage clinic to do massage sometimes uh, wife doesn't know but husband is going to to the massage clinic okay uh, th then there is a sexual misconduct happening lots of thing creating without legalizing also these ladies those who are in massage clinics they are uh, sometimes with their daughter children and they give a bad example for them they become prostitutes so huh then okay uh, also uh, this drug deal behind this maybe marijuana kerala ganja uh, and everything okay also uh, when legalize uh, anyone cannot force to the prostitute to come when illegal now this uh, for example we say a policeman coming and say oh i am a police come here we love sex for without money huh? i am not encouraging this but this is to protect huh? the monks say lots of things uh, thinking only here they have to think more huh? according to lord buddha's dhamma huh? legalizing prostitution is not a problem oh he says stop sexual intercourse uh, get rid of your wife or husband uh, that is what we say that what i say that what what did buddha say okay this is the thing legalizing we can prevent sexual misconduct not totally but we can however uh when it is legal uh the, most of the time sexual misconduct will not happen also when uh, it is legal uh, government will publish it those who are coming hiddenly to do prostitution will not come there after huh? sometimes they they are for we can prevent not sometimes it will happen okay the most ladies going uh, for that uh, uh, without knowing others okay anyway these people are acting uh, like uh, uh, very uh, uh, we have no sex like that but all have sex uh, that is why uh, getting married uh, it's not perfect love if my if it is perfect love why we need a body eh huh? for example uh, when husband going with another uh, lady or oh, wife going with a, another man then these people get angry also killing eh huh? why eh huh? they say oh we love from our heart now heart is where where is genitals this is the thing this genitals are submerged sex is submerged in mind uh, one or two that is sex uh, 
we say we love from our heart where is heart i am not telling that uh, going with another when having uh, one is good it is not good to but hmm, actually what is happening huh? when uh, your boyfriend or girlfriend going with another one huh? you get angry then this anger contains sex huh? like water contains some sort of solid huh? but according to this this sex is higher <laughs> people are joking people are acting a drama but everywhere are sex uh, now in some countries legalized it is good to prevent this criminal cases happening behind this okay now it's a then i say oh stop sexual this things will they stop can i stop can you stop no government can prevent yeah this monks will say oh this is not good this is bad yeah not thinking deeply ha huh? according to dhamma Uh, monks cannot do a uh, protest uh, that is uh, not the buddha's teaching okay uh, i give an example according to lord buddha's time king bimbisara was jail did buddha tell okay sari putta come will do a protest uh, no monks cannot do upavasa or protest according to the lord buddha in an instant after death go to hell don't worry about that doing meditation coming up to sotapanna state only you can prevent going to hell monks cannot take a side this is monks can advise meaningfully to the politics cannot have a party cannot have a political party cannot have any organizations like that monks cannot go to the parliament okay you can do anything but he is there ready for you no problem for me i am not angry but what you think is not important for me because i know who i am and what i think this for welfare of human beings okay monks can advise politics meaningfully for welfare of human beings that is the god of the mahaparinibbana so true also buddha did that i am a son of lord buddha thank you metri bhajan bless you all.